Hi everyone, welcome back to my channel and welcome back to another hotel review video. I'm Wondering Nancy and if you haven't already subscribed my channel, please don't forget to do so because every Friday I'm gonna upload one hotel review video to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to have a hotel review on the Ritz Carlton in Melbourne, which was just opened on 24th of March 2023. Ritz Carlton Melbourne is actually the second Ritz Carlton hotel in Australia. The first one is located in Perth, Western Australia. Just after its opening, it's already ranked as the highest hotel in Melbourne. Before we get on to the uh, main video of the room to the hotel to, I'd like to give you a wrap up on highlights, lowlights, and the membership benefits for staying at the Ritz Carlton Melbourne. So let's start from the highlights. There are absolutely so many things I really love. Uh, to be honest, this is so far my favorite hotel in Australia. It really gives me a feelings of staying at a luxury hotel in Europe. As you know, this is the highest hotel in Melbourne. So really high level, very good view, epic view, love it. And the second highlight is uh, I think the outlay of the room is really, really reasonable. Even though it's not as sweet, but it really gives me a feeling of a suite. It has a separate toilet, a separate makeup room, and a separate shower room, and a bathtub, etc. The amenities are all from the typical, which is really good. I love it. Another highlight is of course the bed and the pillow. So comfortable. Yeah, I just want to buy a pillow after <laughs> sleeping there. The welcome gift is super good. Uh, we received a bottle of wine and uh, we received a very beautiful chocolate dessert. It uh, tastes so good. Um, I had it uh, like so much. Uh, swimming pool was very, very lovely. The restaurant is at level 80. It's fantastic vibe, epic view. I highly recommend to have a breakfast there. And the food quality is really amazing. Talking about low light, to be honest, I think I'm very picky here, but this is Ritz Carlton, so it's reasonable to be picky. There's no in-room dining menu in the hotel room. I'd appreciate if they prepare some sort of menu in the room, prepare more information there. That's going to be great. But there's no in-room dining menu in this room. And also because, you know, uh, Ritz Carlton is one of the Marriott Bombay hotels as well. For most of the Marriott Bombay hotels, you can uh, request services via the Marriott Bombay apps but this one we can't so it's just not very convenient although you can always like make a phone call to the reception to request any services you want but I'd prefer to use that app that's gonna be super convenient if they had that one. Then talking about membership benefits, as a uh, Mary Bombay Titanium, um, we've received welcome amenities and our room has been upgraded. However, we have to pay for our own breakfast. The price actually was quite reasonable there though. Yeah, um, I really love this hotel. Um, I hope you love it. This is also my first day at the Ritz Carlton Hotel. So very good impression. I'd love to explore more Ritz Carlton hotels in the future. Uh, if you think this video is useful to you, please don't forget to hit this like button. And again, if you haven't already, please don't forget to subscribe my channel. Every Friday, a new video will be there. And uh, now let's get started. So um, this lift will take us in just 45 seconds all the way to the 80th floor. Uh -huh. These, um, this express lift only goes all the way up to the 80th floor and back to the ground floor. And then you take another lift and that will take you to your room. Okay. On the 80th floor we've got the restaurant, yeah. the atria, we've yeah. got cameo, that's the bar. Yeah. And of course the lounge where you'll be able to order coffee or something to okay. eat. Okay. On level 64 we have the spa the pool and also the gym. Hey, how are you? Thank you. Wow, look at the view, guys. I'm now currently on the 80th floor. So the reception is on the 80th floor and we can have a full view of the uh, Yarra River. Hey 
guys, welcome to Race Carlton. So now I'm gonna give you a very thorough room tour, and I hope you will enjoy this room tour. On my left side, there are two switch panels. When my hand is closing to this panel, it turns on the light automatically. But if you wanna switch off any of those um, functions, you have to press this one instead of touching it. It is a uh, bathroom. It is a bathroom, like a um, separate bathroom. Uh, we got a beautiful vase right here. So it's silk bar, which is really lovely. And look at this tiny, like very, very small basin. It looks so cute. So this bench is a marble made. It's really good. Nice touch. And here is the toilet. And I got an extra toilet roll just right over there. Okay. Luxury bathroom. Just come on in. Just let me start from this separate shower room. We got a rain shower head, a separate shower head. Another thing to notice is like there's a bench right here. And all those amenities are from Diptico. And here again, we got another basin. Those basins are with the standard sizes. As that one is like really cute and small one. Standard size basins, like two basins. We got a charging socket right over there. And another tiny box just over there. Another soap bar. And this is the body lotion from this one as well. I really love this color of this marble. It's like creamy, a little bit white, makes it look so clean and tidy. Got an embroidery board, comb and shaving kit. The vanity pack, shower kit and a mouthwash. Exfoliating mitt and a tooth case here. A lot of towers. Uh, over there and there's a rubbish bin on the left side here dryer and a pouch so cool and another art decor just right over there so everything is marble opposite to this bathroom this is our wardrobe session i'll call it a makeup room two extra pillows of the top iron an iron board and another bathrobe right here because this one is really good for uh, doing makeup things and there is even a charging socket right here and so in room safe very standard and laundry bags those are cloth made most of them were like plastic but this one cloth made the uh, sleepers color matches to the uh, rope color very good this is a very large mirror got a Four bottles of complimentary water and Nespresso machine and the coffee capsules and this is the kettle. Over the top, uh, got some decor two books right here and some wines up there. Got um, those lovely snacks and uh, nuts inside it. Mini fridge, we got uh, some wines and some drinks inside it. Here are those mugs, play spoons and all those complimentary drinks. The tears is from Twinies. It even provides the adapter in this room. Got some knife and forks inside it. So wood on each of the side and this marble in the middle of this table. I really love this part. The light is uh, just the right mood. Here are our complimentary drinks and I got a bottle of wine and here's our complimentary dessert. I really want to have a bite because it looks so young. Then here comes to our flat screen TV. Then got some more decors on this side as well. So that is the uh, Southern Cross Station. And on the other side, that is the Marvel Stadium. Yeah. I just want to say it's very smart to put a mirror like this here because with this a little bit go so you can make this room like more spacious. There are two USB out sockets and one charging socket here. Then we've also got a Bluetooth speaker. We got a torch inside it. It's a little bit far away from this bed. I'm not sure why, but I prefer this when it's close to the recharging socket. Two USB outlets right here and again, uh, switch panel right here. So there's a sliding door right here. So when I slide this door to the other side, we can see the bathtub. That is our shower room just over there. Wow, guys, um, I really love it. This is probably so far my favorite hotel in Australia. I'm not gonna say that my favorite hotel in Melbourne. Of course it is, but it's gonna be my favorite hotel in Australia. The, uh, the design, the art decor, 
and the architecture and all the, the amenity brand it and all those settings is just perfect and of course it's very expensive as well but I do love it and the view look at the view it's amazing tomorrow morning we're gonna check out the breakfast it's gonna be a la cup breakfast tomorrow uh, so yeah we'll see how it goes hope you like this video thank you I just forgot to mention so you can control the blind and the curtains right right here so just let me press this one it's going to close automatically 